Hi um, to all participants of the Echelon Satellite Malaysia 2013. Uh, I'm Nazrin, uh, and firstly, I'd like to apologize that uh, I'm not there with all of you today. Uh, by the time you get this video, I'll probably have, be halfway across the world in Lyon um, attending a meeting with the World Entrepreneurship Forum. Uh, however, you know, I'd like to congratulate uh, E27 uh, uh, on uh, being able to organize uh, the Echelon Satellite 2013 in Malaysia. Uh, this is an effort that has uh, been ongoing for, for the last two years. Two years ago, I tried to bring the event here and uh, no one is happier that the event is finally here uh, than me. Uh, and um, I feel that uh, it is uh, about time that uh, Malaysian startups get an opportunity to participate uh, in the regional event like Echelon. I've always felt that um, we have uh, very good developments going on in the Malaysian technopreneur uh, ecosystem and that a lot and, uh, of our entrepreneurs are actually quite good uh, and can be uh, readily uh, exposed to the uh, regional ecosystem. And uh, our participation in Echelon uh, is our bid to actually increase the exposure of our local entrepreneurs to the regional scene so that more people will know about the Malaysian technology entrepreneurship scene in Malaysia and more Malaysian technology entrepreneurs will know um, about the requirements uh, to, to expand their business uh, regionally, the opportunities um, and to get to know the community on a regional basis as well. Um, therefore, I feel that uh, it is incumbent upon Cradle to play this role in strengthening our uh, uh, Malaysian entrepreneur landscape all this while, uh, Cradle has played a, a very important role in the Malaysian technopreneurship landscape uh, in supporting particularly early stage technology companies. What we strive to do is not to only provide funding, but to provide uh, a holistic ecosystem at the early stages which involves mentors, commercialization partners. Um, and uh, part of us uh, value adding to the local ecosystem is to encourage uh, more angel investors to invest in uh, local technology companies. Recently, under the budget 2013, um, the government had announced uh, the passing of the angel tax incentive, which Cradle had lobbied for for about three years. And what this uh, tax incentive does is that it entitles an investor to a tax exemption of up till 500,000 ringgit per annum on any investment that it does in an early stage um, technology company. Uh, we believe that this incentive will incentivize uh, more individuals to come forward and fund technology companies uh, and uh, provide a more vibrant uh, funding environment for technology entrepreneurs. Um, as it is, what we're finding is that the response um, from uh, taxpayers has been really good. Everybody's looking forward to hearing more about the tax incentive and to take, uh, to take advantage of it. Uh, and uh, we are looking forward to increasing the number of angel investors within the next uh, five years or so. Um, I think uh, for now, what is important is that we increase the visibility of Malaysia, uh, not only uh, regionally but globally. Uh, and my hope is that Echelon will play that role uh, in uh, increasing our profile, not only the profile of our entrepreneurs, of which we have many talented ones, but the profile of Malaysia as a whole as a base to actually catalyze and grow technology startups. On a last note, I'd like to thank um, um, Mohan and his team at E27, uh, Daniel and his team at Next Up Asia, and our co-sponsor MathCap for making this event a reality in Malaysia. Thank you very much for all your support. Um, I wish for all of you to have a good event, have a good echelon, and um, all the best.